In this part of a review, we are doing the multimeter test while we are trying to use the maximum load on the uh, power supply. We're trying to, to uh, draw as much as possible with 1000 watts. Now, the Platinum Max can draw to 1100 watts, and right now we are drawing from the wall around 1005. It's the maximum I have recorded, and uh, this we're looking at the 12 volt rail right now. And I'm going to move it. And you also hear I've, uh, the fans are quite loud since everything is running at uh, maximum. And I'm going to move the leads now to the 5 volt. You can see there. And uh, to reach the that much load with just two cards, what we did, of course, was overclock our X79 system. And we I pumped in uh, 1.48 volts there. And now we're going to move to the 3.3 volts. Let's look for the orange sleeve and. There you go. We normally do tests on uh, OCCT with the uh, 5 volt, 12 volt, and 3.3 volt rail readings uh, using that software. But uh, unfortunately, the uh, OCCT 4.0 and this particular motherboard, the Sabertooth X79, uh, is, uh, doesn't seem to be able to read the 5 volt uh, reading. Right? It can only pull up the 3.3 uh, volt and the 12 volt after the software. So we're doing our uh, multimeter test, showing you, showing to you in the video form. All right, then. As you can see, it was pretty stable, and uh, I'm going to now run it, it at at idle and see how much the voltage, uh, what the voltages are at the minimum, draw around 10, 20 percent load. All right, so now we are actually going to measure the uh, idle voltages. Let's, let's start with the I'll plug in my multimeter now. You can see the 12 volt rail there. leave it running for a while and uh, I'm using the Corsair H100 that's probably what you're hearing in the back the uh, for the CPU fan I have actually lowered the instead of running overclock since I'm only trying to measure about 20% uh, uh, low I'm trying to keep the system at 20% load uh, right now it's actually around 15-20% 140 it should be the idle uh, for the X7 system 140 or 150 uh, watts and this is what you measure with the 12 volt rail, 2.23. And let's move to the. It's okay, let me just move that uh, lead down to the 5 volt rail. Let me just find that. There you go. And I, uh, I am, as I was saying, the, I am using the Corsair H100, and I'm, you know, hearing it because it's, uh, it's running it, running at the balanced uh, setting. Instead of the lowest, just to keep temperatures in check. Actually, uh, I could run it at the lowest. Let me just uh, that's so you can hear me better. And uh, there we go. And uh, we only needed the we only need H100 to run at maximum speed when we overclock because the uh, LGA 2011 processors can run quite hot once you pump in 1.47, 1, 1.475 or 1.48 voltages and upwards you need a lot of cooling and see 5.08 that is very good and move to the final one move to the orange lead which is the 3.3 volt now I have to hold it in let's see it is quite stable well, it's idle uh, usually, uh, it's important to see, uh, especially with the high-capacity power supplies, to see the uh, 
how well it performs when it's not drawing, uh, when it's drawing less than half of what it's rated at, or even 10 or 20 percent of what it's, its uh, rating capacity is. Right now, I'm looking at the uh, power draw. And the wall is actually low at 137. It's the lowest, 137, 140, fluctuating around that area. I have uh, the power saving enabled. I have loaded the optimized default in the BIOS, so I'm not running an overclock yet. And perfect. Now, let's, uh, let's try to run. Under test, you try loading it and see how well it performs. Now we are running the 50% load test. I uh, I just installed a single GTX 580 this time, but uh, this one has an unlocked power limiter, so it, we are drawing 507 watts is the maximum I have recorded uh, peak load while loading it, and I have the uh, CPU and the motherboard settings at default with the Windows setting set to balanced instead of high performance. And this is the 12 volt line. As you can see, 12.22. Very stable. I'm running the OCCT 4.0 power supply test. And we are going to move to the 5 volts. And right now the maximum uh, is still 507. And I am going to move the lead to the 3.3 volt, which is the orange wire here, power supply. Let's look for that. Okay. And here we go. And as you can see, 3.33 volts. And OCCT is running. It's very, very stable. And right now the load is fluctuating. The lowest is, uh, the lowest I've recorded, uh, while well, the peak load I've recorded highest was 507 watts. The lowest was 427 under load, uh, under the power supply test with OCCT. As you can see, all the rails have, are pretty stable. 